Eight seconds on the clock. Nance unloads. He's not going to get it. Duckworth the rebound. Plays it with a chance to take the lead. Andy, you got to come back with the same situation. Sanders has got to, they, to have the load, and they've got to force the mismatch through him. They come to Duckworth instead. Doherty on him. Backs in. Puts it up and down. He kissed the glass. Duckworth over Doherty. Lagers have the lead. Terrific play by Duckworth. Need a stop. There's the time on the clock. Sanders back to Elo. Nance, 10 seconds on the clock. Nance, and he goes. Offensive foul. Backing in Larry Nance. Williams goes down. Blazers get the ball. Well, this is what happened when a team gets tentative. As you can see, initially he was trying to knock Buck Williams away. Buck drew the foul. Now Portland wants to come back with a good offensive set. Blazers on a 10 to 4 run. They lead and they have the ball right now. Strickland. They want to go through Cliff Robinson on the post by himself. And he goes, puts it up. No, it doesn't drop. But 29 seconds to go. 95 94 Portland. Lenny Wilkins calls for a timeout. All right, 22 seconds remaining. 22.8. 18 on the shot clock. But Portland leading by one. 22 seconds and a scotch to go, Steve, in a one point game. One point game, four in a shot clock game differential. What Portland wants out of this is good defense. They don't want to bail them out and put them on the line. You want them, if they're going to score, to be scoring on a tough try. You see the timeout situation. Portland with two and 120. Cleveland, one and one. 18 seconds on a 24 second clock. Sanders will inbound. Blazers would love a stop here. Nance. Brandon Sanders nine seconds on the shot clock Nance Buck Williams is on him over to Brandon three seconds two they're not going to get it off they turn it over pressure by Portland well, that was tentative play Six by the Cleveland remaining. Cavaliers and they end up putting the ball in Terrell Brandon's hand trapped on the sidelines they force a mistake now all Portland has to do is inbound the ball and hold it. Price not in the game, not oh, playing tonight, know. and Brandon was the man, and they forced Brandon and the Cavs to turn the ball over. Six seconds to go. Defensively, the Blazers getting it done in the last few moments. To just get the ball in, get it into somebody. There's Porter. Buck, get it in. They do to Mario Ellie. Ellie fouled. 4.6 ticks of the clock to go. Here's the free throw, folks. We'll watch. Time out. He's got it. 4.6 seconds to go. Portland leading by two. Elo. Nance. Elo. Unloads. Glass. That's all. Rebound. Strickland at the horn. And the Blazers win the ball game. They go two and two on this road trip. They wanted to finish strong. They did. And here in Cleveland, Ohio, after being down by four, going into the fourth and final period, they win the game by a final score of Portland 96, Cleveland 94.